The Indian Army has recently procured Milrain Robotics, tracked hybrid modular infantry system Themis unmanned ground vehicle UGV from Estonia. Themis has been making waves in the military technology sector, and India became the latest country to add it to its arsenal. The addition of Themis to the Indian Army would provide a significant boost to their capabilities. Its versatility and advanced technology makes it a valuable addition to any military's arsenal and it has already proven itself to be effective in the battlefield. It is likely that Themis would be used for a variety of missions in the Indian Army, including reconnaissance, surveillance, transportation, and logistics tasks. During the ongoing parliamentary session, Ajay Bhatt, Minister of State for Defence, said that in the last three years India has imported Themis unmanned ground vehicle, loitering munitions as well as closed-in weapon systems, 7.62 into 51mm arsenal machine gun and ground support missile test equipment. Themis is a versatile and highly advanced unmanned ground vehicle UGV that has a range of potential applications in military operations, from reconnaissance and surveillance to logistics and transportation. With its ability to operate in a variety of environments and complete tasks with a high degree of autonomy, Themis has the potential to significantly enhance the capabilities of the Indian military. The Themis unmanned ground vehicle UGV by Milram Robotics has been proven effective in various exercises, experiments, and even the Operation Barkhan mission in Mali. Its primary purpose is to reduce the number of troops needed on the battlefield by performing a variety of roles, including transportation, ordnance disposal, intelligence operations, and even being weaponized. It has already been purchased by 16 countries, 8 of which are members of NATO, including the United States, the United Kingdom, Spain, Norway, the Netherlands, Germany, France, and Estonia. The system can be configured to be used for logistics, combat, intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance ISR, or explosive ordnance disposal EOD. The UGV has a payload capacity of 750 kg with an open architecture. Themis is a small, tracked unmanned vehicle that is 7.8 feet long and 3.75 feet high. Hence, it can be fitted with a variety of payloads depending upon the demand of the operation or the unit. It may be used for normal cargo, mortar or case vac, a platform for rapid evacuation and in a combat role, the payload offerings include cannons, javelin missiles, counter unmanned aerial system and even loitering munitions. It is a highly advanced UGV that is equipped with a range of technical features to support military operations. It has a maximum speed of 20 km per hour and a maximum payload capacity of 1250 kg and is equipped with advanced sensors and cameras that allow it to perform tasks with a high degree of autonomy and navigate challenging terrain. It is powered by a hybrid electric drive system that combines an internal combustion engine with an electric motor, providing a range of up to 15 hours on a single tank of fuel. Themis is also designed to be highly rugged and durable, with a reinforced steel and aluminum body that can withstand rough terrain and extreme weather conditions. Ukraine's ongoing war has become a major testing ground for autonomous and improved vehicles powered by artificial intelligence. While the use of military robots is not a new concept, remote-controlled war machines were used during World War II and the US deployed fully autonomous assault drones in 2020. Milram Robotics has recently announced that the German Ministry of Defense has ordered 14 of its Themis unmanned ground vehicles UGV, to be sent to the Ukrainian forces for immediate use. The Themis UGV will be used for casualty evacuation and for finding and removing landmines and similar devices, and will not be armed. But, it is likely that the Ukrainian forces will find other uses for the Themis UGV, such as carrying equipment and supplies, as they are equipped with Milram's intelligence function kit. It is also possible that the Themis UGV could be re-equipped with combat modules or have homemade autonomous weapon systems mounted on top of them. With the addition of these 14 UGV, the Ukrainian forces will have the world's largest complement of Themis UGV. In an effort to close the gap in its technological knowledge, Russia's Center for Analysis of Strategies and Technologies CAST has offered a cash reward for the capture of a Themis unmanned ground vehicle, UGV. CAST recognizes that Russia is behind in the development of autonomous vehicles and hopes to use a captured Themis to accelerate the development of Russian technology in this area. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe.